हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज वसीम एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू माय चैनल स्मार्ट स्टडी सो फ्रेंड्स टुडे एज यू हैव सीन हियर आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस टेन इंपॉर्टेंट नंबर सीरीज क्वेश्चंस व्हिच आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फ्रॉम द पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू ऑफ एनी बैंक एग्जामिनेशन स्पेशली एसबी क्लर्क एंड एसबी पीओ एग्जामिनेशन सो फ्रेंड्स बिकॉज़ देयर विल बी फाइव क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम दिस पर्टिकुलर सेक्शन इन any bank examination from quantitative aptitude so i thought to discuss these questions with you so friends when you come across the question try to solve the questions by yourself then continue watching the video without wasting much time let's go ahead as you can see the first question here is 5 question mark 41 191 9 941 9, 4691 so see here friends by looking at these values we cannot do anything with this so let's check from here so if you look at these values so 41 and 191 so if you look at this value if you take it approximately 40 so if you take it approximately 190 or 200 this is 4 to 5 times of 41 again if you see 191 if you compare 191 with 941 so this is again like uh, five, approximately 5 times so what i'm going to do here is i'm just directly going to take the i mean i'm just going going to multiply the values with uh, some values like uh, 41 into 4 times so 41 into 4 times let's try to multiply so 41 into 4 times is 160 160 40 into 4 is 4 so sorry 4 into 1 is 4 so 160 plus 4 is 164 so we have to convert this value as 191 to convert this value as 191 I am just going to add some more value. I have to add something. That is six plus twenty one. Six plus twenty one are this is plus twenty seven. Again, to convert as one ninety one into five. So, I mean, to convert one ninety one as nine forty one, I am going to multiply with five. So this is if it is like two hundred five into two hundred is one thousand because it is we have taken nine nine extra. We have to subtract that. So forty-five. We have to subtract. The remaining value here is so nine hundred and fifty-five. So nine fifty-five. But this this has to be nine forty-one. If you are going to subtract some value like fourteen out of this, so this will be like nine hundred and forty-one. In the same manner, so to convert as nine forty-one as four hundred four thousand six ninety-one. So I am just going to multiply this nine forty-one with uh approximately 5 times so 941 into 5 times is 5047 uh, 4705 so 4705 minus i mean we have to subtract something that is we have to subtract 14 out of this so again the value becomes 4691 if you look at these values there is no point at all so we cannot do anything with this so if you look at this values there is no point at all so therefore though it is look, it seems to be a multiplication series we cannot do anything with this so let's try to take the differences here so 5 question mark 41 9 191 941 and 4691 so we cannot do anything with this let's try to take the differences from here so 191 minus 41 is 150 Again, nine forty one minus one ninety one is seven hundred and fifty. Again, four thousand six ninety one minus nine forty one. This is like three thousand seven hundred and fifty. So this is three thousand seven fifty. So see, our friends, one fifty into five times is seven fifty. Seven fifty into five five times is three thousand seven fifty. Or you can take this in a reverse manner. Three thousand seven fifty divided by five is seven fifty. Seven fifty divided by five is one fifty. Then now it should be one fifty. Divided by five should be thirty. So if we subtract thirty from forty-one, the value is equal to eleven here. So again, let's check further. So thirty divided by five. So thirty divided by five is equal to six. So eleven minus six is equal to five. So therefore, this is absolutely correct logic. So therefore, we have to do in this manner. So see, our friends, because I'm explaining it, it is taking much time for me. But if you do it in the actual exam, it will not take you much time. So try to practice more amount of questions of this kind so that you can crack it very easily. And uh, if you have any practice, this will not take you around four five seconds, and this will take you around a maximum of twenty seconds. By twenty five thirty seconds, you will be coming. 
uh, I mean, you will be getting the answer. So therefore, here our answer should be 11. That is nothing but option E should be the answer. I hope you understood. Let's check out the next question here. So the question here is 5000, 2508, 1262, 639, question mark, 1171.75. So see here friends, so to convert 5000 as 2508, so it is almost half of the value of 5000. Again, 1262 is also half of the value of 2508. So again, 639 is also half of, almost half of the value of 1262. So let's try to divide and let's try to add something and try to get the answers here. So how can 5000 be made as 2508? So if we divide 5000 by 2, this becomes 2500. So 2500, so we have to make this as 2508. So if we are going to add 8 to this value, this will be like 2508. Again, how can we convert 2508 as 1262? So to convert this to 1262, so what can we do here is let's divide the previous value by 2. So if we divide this value by 2, this is like 1254. 1254 is equal to 1262. So to make this value as equal, we have to add 8 to this value. So 1254 plus 8 is equal to 1262. Again, how can we make 1262 as 639? So let's divide by 2. That is 631. So 631 plus so we have to add 8 to this value 631 plus 8 is equal to 639 so let's check further let's i mean we have to do the same thing for further as well so 639 divided by 2 is 314.5 so sorry 31 3 it is uh, there are some calculations mistake sorry for this so 319.5 plus 8 so 319.5 plus 8 is equal to 327.5. So because we are adding every time 8, so I'm just adding 8 by dividing the value by dividing the previous value by 2. So 327 by 0.5 divided by 2. So here our answer should be 327.5. That is nothing but option C. Let's check further. 327.5 divided by 2. That is 163. Uh, 163.75 plus 8 is equal to 171.75. So therefore, the logic which we have applied here is absolutely correct. I hope you understood. Let's check out the next question. So 9, 5, question mark, 10.5, 2360. So 9, 5. So see here friends, so the value has decreased. I think the next value would, would increase compared to 5. And it has in, it has increased. So therefore, how can 9 be made as 5? So let's apply a logic here with our assumption. How can 9 be made as 5? To convert 9 as 5, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to multiply 9 with 0 0.5. So 9 into 0 0.5 is 4.5. 4.5 plus 0 0.5 is equal to 5. So how can 5 be made as next value? So 5 into 1. So because it is 0 0.5, let us multiply with 1. So 5 into 1 is 1 plus 1. So let's assume the answer is 6 here. Let's assume the answer is 6 here and we will we shall check further. So how can 6 be made as 10.5? So 6 into 1.5. So this is 0.5, this is 1. The next let's try to take 1.5. 6 into 1.5 is 9. So 9 plus 1.5 because this is 0.5, this is 1, this is 1.5. Again this is 0.5, this is 1 and this is 1.5. So therefore 6 into 1.5 is 9, 9 plus 1.5 is equal to 10.5. So we are able to convert this value as 10.5 very easily. So let's try to check further. So 10.5 into 2 times is 21. 21 plus 2 is equal to 23. So this is absolutely correct once again. So let's try to do deal with this as well. So 23 into 2.5. So 23 into 2 times. 23 into 2 times is 46. So 46 plus 23 into 0 0.5 is equal to 11.5. So if we add this value, this is 5, this is 7, this is 5, 57.5. So because we have to add, this is 0 0.5, 1, 1.5, 2, the next one must be 2.5. 
So 57.5 plus 2.5 is equal to 60. So therefore, this is absolutely correct. So because of that, the other the value which we have assumed and we tried is absolutely correct. That is nothing but option D should be our answer here. Let's check out the next question here. 551, 600, 636, 661, 677. So the values are increasing in a easy pace. So because this are, these are not increasing in a drastic manner, I can surely say that this is a series of differences here. So let's try to take the differences here. So I'm going to write the series once again just for your sake, which you need not to do in the actual exam. So 677. So let's try to take the differences. 600 minus 551 is plus 49. Again, 636 minus 600 is plus 36. I hope by looking at this value itself, you might have got what logic is following. So 661 minus 636 is plus 25. Again, 677 minus 661 is uh, 7 minus 1 is 6 and 7 minus 6 is 1. This is plus 16. This is 49 is 7 square. 36 is 6 square, 25 is 5 square, 16 is 4 square. The next one must be 7, 6, 5, 4. The next one must be 3 square. If you add 3 square to this value, that is 3 square is nothing but 9. If you add 9 to this value, this becomes 686. That is nothing but option A should be the answer. I hope you understood. This is one of the simple uh, number series question which you can do actually. Let's check out the next question here friends. 16, 18, 27, 55, 120, question mark. So see here friends, the values are increasing here like anything. So because the values are increasing like anything, uh, I can surely say that uh, uh, we have, this is a series of multiplication, I guess. So let's try to do deal with this. So 16, so 16 into 1 is 16 plus 2 is equal to 18. Again, how can be 18 made as 27? So 18 into 1.5 is, it is already 27. So we cannot do anything with this. So let's try to take the differences once again. So because we cannot do at the initial stage itself, I'm just going to delete this. I try in a different manner. So I'm going to take the differences once again. To take the differences, I'm writing the series once again. So 55, 120 and X. So see here friends, the difference between 18 and 16 is plus 2. So 27 and sorry. So 27 and 18. 27 minus 18 is plus 9. Again 55 minus 27. 55 minus 27 is equal to so 27 plus 1. That is 28. 27 into 2, two times is 54. So this is 55. So 27 plus 1 is equal to 28. Again 120 minus 55. That is 45 plus 20 is plus 65. So if you look at these values, you don't understand anything. So see here friends, this can be taken as 1 plus 1. So this can be taken as 1 cube or 1 square plus 1. So this can be taken as 2 cube plus 1. So 2 cube plus 1 is 8 plus 1. So this is 1 cube plus 1 is 2. 2 cube plus 1 is equal to 9. So again 3 cube is 27. 27 plus 1 is equal to 28. This 65 is 4 cube plus 1. So 4 cube is... 64 plus 1 is 65. So this is 65. The next one must be 5 cube plus 1. So 5 cube plus 1. 5 cube is 125. 125 plus 1 is equal to 126. If you add 126 to 120, this is like 246. So therefore, the answer here should be 246. That is nothing but option B should be our answer in this case. I hope you understood. Let's check out the next question here. 4, 19, 64, 139, question mark. 379. So, see here friends, again the values are increasing in a greater pace. So, this is like 4 or 5 times. So, 19 is like uh, 5 or uh, some, something like that. So, let's try to multiply in a 4 or 5 manner. So, 4 into 4 is 16. 16 plus 3 is equal to 19. So, to convert 4 as 19, I have just multiplied 4 with 4 and I have added 3 to this value. 16 plus 3 is equal to 19. So to convert 19 as 64, I'm going to multiply 19 with 3. So 19 into 3 times is 57, 57 plus, so we have to take this value as 64. So 57 plus 7, so 57 plus 7 is equal to 64. So to convert 64 as 139, 
so 64 into 2 times is 128 so 128 so we have to take this value as 139 so 128 plus so we have to add something to this that is 11 so plus 11 if you add plus 11 to uh, 128 so this becomes 139 so see here friends this is 4 this is 3 this is 2 the next one must be 139 into 1 time is 139 so plus so 3 plus 3 is 7 the difference is 4 again 7 and 11 the difference is 4 once again the next difference must be 15 so if you add 15 so see here friends 139 plus 15 there is no such option there is no so called option there so 139 plus 15 is equal to 154 so therefore there is no such option like 150 uh, 150 uh, 5 so therefore this logic doesn't follow so let's try to take the differences here so 4 19 64 139 question mark and 379 if you take out the differences 19 minus 4 is 15 so 64 minus 19 64 minus 19 is equal to so 64 minus 20 is 44 plus 1 that is 45 i hope you understood so 139 minus 64 so 140 minus 6, I mean 139, 9 minus 4 is 5, so 13 minus 6 is 7, this is like plus 75. So therefore, see here friends, the difference between these two values is 13, 45 minus 15 is 30, so 75 minus 45 is also 30, the next difference must be 30. So 75 plus 30 is equal to 105. If you add 105 to this value, 239, 239, 244, 244 should be our answer so let's check further so if you add 30 to this value 105 plus 30 this is 135 if you add 135 to 244 the value would be 973 379 so therefore this is absolutely correct so here answer should be 244 that is nothing but option d should be our answer in this case i hope you understood so see our friends this should not take you much time so by looking at this value itself you have to calculate all these values i hope you understood let's check out the next question here 7 17 37 77 question mark 317 so see our friends if you look at this unit digits so all the unit digits are 7 i hope you understood if you look at this unit digit all the unit digits are 7 so therefore i think the value which comes out to be here that should be ending with 7 i guess so because of that because all the unit digits are ending with 7 i am just going to think that so all the values should end with i mean uh, the differences should be it, it is a series of differences so let's try to take the differences here 7 17 37 77 question mark and 317 so 17 minus 7 is plus 10 37 minus 17 is 20 77 minus 37 77 minus 37 is equal to plus 40 so this is also plus so 10 into 2 is 20 20 into 2 is 40 the next one must be 40 into 2 is 80 plus 80 if you add 80 to this value 80 plus 77 is equal to 157 so therefore let's check further 150 this is 80 so 10 20 40 80 the next one must be plus 60 because the previous value is being multiplied the difference of the previous value is being multiplied so 160 80 into 2 times is 160 if you add 160 to this value so 157 plus 160 this is 7 this is 1 this is 3 this is 317 so therefore this is absolutely correct so our answer here should be 157 that is nothing but option c should be our answer in this case i hope you understood let's check out the next question here so 12 8 10 17 uh, 36 so let's try to take the i mean we cannot deal with differences because the value value has decreased and all the remaining values have keep on increasing so therefore how can we make 12 as 8 so to make 12 as 8 what i'm going to do here is 12 into 0 0.5 is 6 6 plus 2 6 plus 2 is equal to 8 so how can 8 be made as 10 so 8 into 1 time is 8 so 8 plus 2 is equal to 10 so how can 10 be made as 17 so 10 into 1.5 0 0.5 1 the next one must be 1.5 10 into 1.5 is 15 15 plus 2 is equal to 17 how can 17 be made as 36 so this is 0 0.5 1 1.5 the 
the next one must be 17 into 2 times so 17 into 2 times is 34 34 because we are adding 2 extra to every value so therefore 34 plus 2 is equal to 36 so how can 36 i mean the next value must be 36 into 0.51 1.52 the next one must be 2.5 36 into 2 is 78 36 into 0 0.5 is 18 so 72 plus 18 is equal to 90 90 plus 2 is equal to 95 should sorry 92 should be our answer that is nothing but option A should be our answer in this case. I hope you understood. So let's check out the next question here. So 3, 7, 29, 143, 779 question mark. So see here friends, the values are like 3, 7. I mean the values are keep on increasing. So how can we make 3 as 7? So 3 into 2 times is 6. 6 plus 1 is equal to 7. So again, how can 7 be made as 29? 7 into uh, 2 times or 3 times. So 3 into 2 is 6. 6 plus 1 is equal to 7. So 7 into 3 times. Let's take 3 times because it is 2. The next, the next we cannot directly jump to 4, right? So 7 into, we, we shall do in both the ways. 7 into 4 is 28 plus 1. That is 29. So 7 into 3 is 21. So 21 plus 8. 21 plus 8 is equal to 29. So again, how can 29 be made as 143? So 29 into 5 times. So 29 into 5 times is 1, 100. And, so 30 into 5 times is 150. Because we have taken one extra, subtract 1. That is 1 into 5 is 5. So 150 minus 5 is equal to 145. 145 plus 1 should be 146. So this is not following. So let's try to deal with this. So 29 into 4 times. So 29 into 4 times it is uh, 120 minus 4 that is 116. So 116. So we have to take this value as we have to convert this value as 143. If you subtract 143 from this 3 minus 6 is 7. So 3 minus 1 is 2. This is 27. This is plus 27. I hope you understood. So again 143 into 5 times. So 143 into 5 times is 5, uh, 1, 5 into 1 is 5, that is 7, 715, so 715 uh, plus, so we have to take this value as 779, so to make to make this as 779, let us subtract 70, 779 from 7, 715, so 9 minus 5 is 4, 7 minus 1, 7 minus 1 is 6, this is 64, so therefore this is 64, this is 3 here friends, this is 1 cube, this is 2 cube, this is 3 cube, this is 4 cube. The next one must be 5 cube, that is 125. So this is 2, 3, 4, 5. So here it should be 6. So 779, previous value is 779 into 6. 779 into 6. So 6 into 9 is 54, 4 is here. So 6 into 7 is 42, 47, 7 is here, 4 is carried forward. 6 into 7 is 42, 42 plus 4 is 42 plus 4 is 46, 4, 6, 74. So 4674 plus we have to add 125 to this. So 9974, 4799 should be our answer. That is nothing but uh, 47 option D should be our answer. I hope you understood. Let's check out the last question of this session. So the last question here is 45 question mark 88 So see our friends, this question is for you, for your sake. You solve this question and let me know the answer in the comment box. I hope you enjoyed watching this session. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day ahead. So before ending up this session, I request you to subscribe to my channel, like the video, share the video with your friends. And if you have any doubts, please let me know in the comment box. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day ahead.